For much of the history of the United States military, since its inception, horses were the primary means of transportation. This could have changed, if not for the failure of an interesting experiment. In 1856, the United States military decided to embark on an experiment to create the United States Camel Corps. Back in the day, Secretary of War Jefferson Davis imported uh, several dozen of these bad boys. He called them the ships of the desert. Camels served proudly in the United States military up until the Civil War. Camels can go days without water, carry extremely heavy loads, and they're surprisingly versatile in m m most terrain. I don't know why I just had a stroke trying to say that. But I mean, look at them. Just take a look. Right? That's the face of somebody who's ready to blare fortunate sun and take the enemy by force. That's, a, that's the smug look of an animal that knows it's about to put you down and then give you the old, you know, and just spit on you. Horses are great. You know, I, I don't think I've ever met anybody that doesn't like horses. And if I did, I would immediately question their character. But I kind of wish we still had the Camel Corps. Camels kind of look like they're the little sibling of the horses and they just got hurt by the horse and they're going to tell their mom and their mom's going to beat their older horse brother's ass.